Mr. Monk, please bring me a towel. Keep breathing. Oh, I know it hurts. I've been there too. Where'd you get the mask? Left top drawer. It's a natural thing, Mr. Monk. Your mother did it twice. You're not helping at all. She didn't do it in somebody's living room. Shh. She didn't go surprising people. Why, why didn't you tell me she was pregnant? I didn't know. Nobody knew. Come on, you're a woman. How could you not know? It's a disaster. Little animals coming out of other animals. What was God thinking? Oh, it's the miracle of life. It's a beautiful thing. Oh, okay, that's not such a beautiful thing. I mean, in general. This is what I get. For trying to be nice. They open my... Your heart? My house! They open my house! You open your heart, Mr. Monk. Don't close it now. Oh, here it comes, ready or not. No, no, not yet. I'm not ready, please. No, just tell her to wait. Wait, wait, tell her to... No, Chubby, no. Bad dog. You're doing good, Sadie. Keep breathing. Keep breathing. Here it comes. What is that? Oh, wait, that, that can't be right. That is not, That cannot be right. Well, that, that can't be right. That is not right. No way that... Congratulations, Grandpa. Wow. I know. It's a boy. What are you gonna name him? Exhibit A. <laughs> Good girl. Exhibit A. Check out the tail. What tail? Exactly. His father's an Australian Shepherd. A tailless Australian Shepherd. Stephen Dewey. His wife mentioned she'd been traveling recently, and how long was she gone? About three months. That fits. While his wife was out of town, he was having an affair with Amanda. They were hooking up, do you understand? Uh, yeah. And while they were hooking up, their dogs were hooking up. Everybody and everything hooking up. Do you remember two days ago? DeWitt showed up to help look for the body. He was petting Shelby. He was patting her belly. He noticed she was pregnant. DeWitt had a problem. He knew as soon as we saw these tailless puppies, we'd run a DNA test. We'd have proof, living proof, their dogs had met, which proved he knew Amanda. That's why he tried to run her over tonight. Well, looks like we've got our smoking gun. Oh, you're just about the cutest little smoking gun in history. Look at you. <laughs> oh, the jury's gonna eat you up. Oh, wait a minute. I think we have more evidence. Excuse me. Hey, girl, Shelby. Good girl. Okay, here comes exhibit A, B, C, exhibit D. Oh, another one. <laughs> What's the record? Mm. I think it's 101. <laughs> that was the movie. Right. <laughs> uh, that woman, uh, uh, Coupe de uh, Corella. Corella, she was bad news. Mm. Mark, this is good scotch. Where'd you get this scotch? It was a Christmas gift from the mayor. Mm. Well, thank the mayor for me. Ah. Uh. I think she's done. And so am I. Ugh. Randy, you've been a drive. What about DeWitt? We'll pick him up. Call Kramer, have somebody go to his house and uh, put an APB on his vehicle. Yeah, yes, sir. What What do I do? You get some sleep. We'll be back to pick you and the dogs up in the morning. No, 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 no. The puppies. What do I do? Mr. Mike, you don't have to do anything. She knows what she's doing. Bye, Shelby. Good job. You have a lot of explaining to do, young lady.
you're too late. She's already had the letter. What are you gonna do, Steve? Kill them all? This was not him. But I'm a witness, so you'll have to kill me no, no, too. No, don't, don't, don't move. You just stay where you are. I think you're a killer. I think you loved Amanda. It was an accident. I believe you. She fell and hit her head. That's not murder. It's manslaughter, maybe obstruction. That's bad, but it could be a lot worse. Don't make it worse. Don't make it worse. It was an accident. I know. I know it was. They're beautiful.